Hi friends, welcome back to APA tutorial with Laravel 8. In our previous video, we got some idea about how to create API, how to test API and we already discussed about types of requests that is get, post, put, delete and today we will going to discuss about one of the most used things that is search. So how we will use search using the API okay so i will pass any strings or you can see the parameter from the api and based on that parameter laravel will provide as a response okay so here is my laravel application and if you go to the project directory we have the already set up the environment that is my database name is laravel api tutorial so this is the laravel api tutorial and inside this we have the block table so basically we'll search from this block table and for this we have already created a block model and we have also a block controller and we will use postman tool to use with api okay so to search we will create a request and we will use the get request so why get request so basically search means we can say basically it is fetching the list from database or you can say that it's fetching some data from database so when we want to fetch any records from table we will use the gate so here i will use the gate method to search okay so i will create a url so using this url we will pass a parameter and we will so just create a url that is 127.0.0.1 colon 8000 okay and after that the api so basically it is the base url for api calling so we are using this api basically in laravel we will use the api routes so here i will create a parameter that is search data and we will pass a parameter suppose anything i will add in later so first create this search data routes inside the api.php so write route and take a gate method and add this ul search data and here i will accept one parameter so basically this parameter will pass to the controller okay so my controller name is blog controller colon colon class and suppose my method name is search block by name okay so create one methods into the block controller so here we'll write a public function search block by name okay so we will accept this parameter from this method so using this parameter we will filter in records so we'll pass through the postman okay so here my database is showing that is php course okay so i will pass only these things that is php course and it will fetch the records for this string okay so here i am taking a variable that is blog and i have already model to fetch a record from block table so use the blog so basically this is the blog model i am calling this so here we will write the conditional clause that is if the title comma and we'll pass the parameter okay so basically this will fetch the record while the parameter is matches okay and after that the gate and after that return the result okay so just go to the postman and click on the send button so it will fetch the record which title have the php course okay just click on the send so now we can see the result is coming okay so in this way if we just use these things that is laravel course so just click on send it will get the result okay so now if we only pass this course it will not come anything okay so basically it was working as 
the complete matching so if you go to the database we can see in the two rows we have the courses okay so basically when we are using just only where clause it will get the complete matching cases okay so now if we want to make the partial matching means we will write the course and it will fetch these two records okay so how we can do this so very simple we need to use the while curves that is we need to pass the another things so where we need to use the like parameter here so using the like we will get the partial matching things and we need to use the percentage here so if anything matches with between this percentage it will fetch the record so use this okay so now if we go to the postman and click on the send we will get the two records okay so it matches with courses and if you want to fetch any common things that is suppose c so just go to the postman and pass the c so we can see there is already three records because in the technology we have c also okay so in this way we can search with the api and we can search with the complete match and we can search with the partial matches so this is all about laravel search api and it is most used things while you are creating any apis or if you want to create any projects it is the mostly used things okay so if you have any queries about this video please comment in the below comment section next day we will going to show you how to validate any api okay so please like and subscribe this channel for upcoming video thanks for watching this video bye bye